I just realized I wasn't recording. That's fine. All that happened is I'm fighting Mesmer. So, YouTube video people, you didn't miss anything. Okay, bro. Okay. Stop taunting me. Let's go. Let's do something here, please. Yep. And there's more to that combo? Uh, I think I hit a button accidentally. Thank goodness the, the bosses don't have input reading anymore. I messed up. I need to heal. Amazing. Amazing. Thank you, Mesmer. Thank you, Mesmer. Thank you, Mesmer. Appreciate it, Mesmer. Thank you, Mesmer. Thank you, Mesmer. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna first try him. But that's what it seems like for the video people. I'm gonna heal up. We're gonna not get grabbed by that. I uh, what? Huh? I'm dead. He has a <laughs> he has a, he has a fire impale fire. <laughs> you cannot. You literally it doesn't matter how much vigor you have. You're dying instantly. There's no way you're living through that if you get grabbed by that. That's the most OP grab attack in the game. It's really easy to dodge though. I just I just messed up. <clears throat> okay. I'm gonna try Tish. See if Tish gives me a little help. Cause people are saying that all the bosses in this game are super super hard, even with summons, and I'm like, even with summons, they are difficult, but like I haven't had that much trouble so far. Okay, okay, that's my bad. That's my bad. That's actually my bad though. That's that's actually my bad. <laughs> It's like Mortal Kombat Pro that make one combo for 75% HP. Yeah. Professional Mortal Kombat players are insane. Like most fighting games, too. I get a headache trying to watch Professional Smash or something. It's, it's crazy. Not that I watch much professional fighting games. I don't really play fighting games all that much. Got it, got to heal, got to heal. I'm gonna run away. Tish, Tish! Tish does not want to help me. It's okay, that's easily avoidable. That's the grab, that's the, I'm, I messed that up so bad. <laughs> he dashed forward and I ran into him while he was dashing. What a mess. What a mess, Mer. Play fighting games like 20, 25 years ago on the Sega NES. <laughs> I just, I don't, I just don't really like fighting games. Even the classic, Marvel vs. Capcom, like some older Mortal Kombat's, like, I played Injustice, like, in college I, I would play a lot of Injustice just at parties with friends, but it wasn't like, I didn't really like the game itself, I liked playing with friends. Wow. I think I need to get good. Okay, let me actually put on some fire resistances now because that's what I said I was going to do, and I didn't. So I need to figure this out. Uh, I guess raise HP, equip load, stamina. That's that's good, I suppose. Greatly boost fire damage negation. Now, can I put this on? No, I can't. Okay. Uh, I don't care about this. What are some other ones that might be good? Boost max HP by the utmost. What is what does that give me? Twenty two fourteen or tw so okay so that's an extra two hundred HP. That's actually that may be the difference between life and death. I don't know. Completely just gonna switch out everything here. Uh, raises fire attack. No 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 no. Raises attack power defeat. Successive attacks restore HP. This this may be good. I think. Um, increase poise after using a flask of tears, raise dex, <clears throat> raise resistance. I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna try successive attacks, restore HP, and see if that's any good or if it's just useless. I'm also gonna throw on a physic flask thing that... Where's the one that messes with your... Is it this one? No, enhance spontaneous guard. 
There's one that heals. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Steadily restores HP of nearby allies for a time in mixed physic. Yes. This is what I want. And then I'm still keeping on the Twiggy Cracked tier because I'm worried about losing my 180,000 runes. Do you have any other fire resistance things? I'm pretty sure I can craft some stuff. Coats armament inflicting blood loss. This might be good. I'm going to craft some of these. Let me just... Sure, it's my 14 of these. Why not? I need to try and see what his weakness is. I'm going to try bleed since he doesn't have much armor. He has a lot of exposed flesh. And then we'll do boost fire damage negation. I think that's good for now. Okay. <clears throat> so I'm going to drink this. I'm going to drink this. And I'm going to walk in here. And then I'm going to do this. And then I'm going to summon. That was a bad idea. Shut up. Don't worry about it. It's fine. Oh, it's, it's that delayed drag on the ground that, that really gets me. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, better. I really messed up reading his attacks that time, though. Get this. Get this. Whip on one of these. Walk through here. Pull up the homie. Let's go. I keep going too, too early on those dodges. Like that, like that was, that was absolutely horrible. Go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. All right, Tish, thank you for the distraction. Appreciate it, girl. I'm gonna... Look at my health. I shouldn't have gone for three there. This guy's insane. This guy's insane. How does it... Is he... Is he healing? Crazy. That's that's such a cool attack. Absolutely insane, though. All right, I'm below half heals. This is not good. Oh, oh, a little bit of lag there. I should heal. I should have healed. Is he healing? Why does it feel like his health is going up? Is he healing? He has a little bit of delays. And like the second that I... The second that I dodge, I can feel that I dodge too early. But that's the problem, is that I've already dodged. Maybe I try someone else besides Tish? Oh, see, I messed that up. I had my shield up. Okay, I'm messing some stuff up here. There we go. I got that even though I dodged early. I dodged early again there. Dodged early again there. I didn't dodge at all. Now I need to heal. Heal, please. Okay, not gonna risk the double heal there. Okay, he's he's on to Tish. I'm gonna do this. I shouldn't have done that. Now I'm gonna... Now I'm gonna not do that. He's got a lot of attacks. The, the white HP is... That's just an effect from Tisha's thing. So, like, I expect him to... I think that can be discarded or, he, or done away with, I think. But it's something else with... I don't know. I don't think he has bleed. 
That, see, that was way too early. Okay, this is a better run already. Not a lot of damage for a crit attack, but okay. I'll take it. I'm starting to get the timing of some things down, I think. This music is so cool. Wait, why does it feel like that? Hmm. No, that was a mistake. Let's go. <laughs> Tish is great. I love Tish. Her only issue is she she can be kind of... She can die pretty quickly. To some bosses, like Mesmer, who does insane damage. But I'm stunning him a decent amount. That's such a crazy attack, dude. I love okay, that that's such a that's such a great attack opening. Like after he does any sort of slam. Oh my goodness. Wow, he's he's really susceptible to to those kinds of things. Okay, he's he's not that bad actually. I take back what I said. I I just need to get good. That's my problem is I was just not getting good. Okay, are, is, is this a no? This isn't a second phase. This is just that move again. This is a second phase. I don't know what second phase is. But this is it. Whatever it is. Oh my goodness. What is phase two? What is phase two? That was a good first phase. I'm scared though. He's dead. I killed him. And I killed him. Yay. He's dead. <laughs> He's like, I won't be beaten by you. Uh oh. No mother. Forgive me. Torn is just standing there like, oh yeah, get through your phase transition, bro. Uh-oh. 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 Why do you have your eyeball? Your eye is glass? Oh no. First phase is actually not hard if I can get the timings down. First phase is actually not bad. Here we go. Here we go. Oh no. Oh no. This is about to be the sickest design I've ever seen in my life, isn't it? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> the flame coming from his eye. That's crazy. Wait. 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 What? 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 What?
What? Is that a bug? What? What? Remembrance of Mesmer the Impaler hit hewn into the Scatter Tree. The power of its namesake can be unlocked by the Finger Reader. Alternatively, it can be used to gain a great bounty of runes. A malevolent snake writhed within Mesmer, and so his very mother plucked out his eye and put in its place a seal of grace. Yet having done so, her fear compelled her to secret away her child within the realm of shadow, hidden away, keeping company with the original sin and a hatred that would not be confined. What? The kindling that burned inside Mesmer the Impaler, a dark thing eaten away at by a wicked serpent, burns the ceiling tree set to be found at the old Rao ruins. Mesmer, much like his younger sister, bore a vision of fire. What? Let me... I, I need to look this up. I need to do some research. Is this a bug? Is this a... What? Is this a... Is this a bug? It is. It is. What? It's a bug. It's a bug. I was just cheated out of his entire phase two. Yes. Yes. It's a bug. It's... Uh, wh what even happened? Let me see. What? Mesmer phase two dies instantly. Bug. Guys, I just had a bug that instantly killed Mesmer after a phase two cutscene spawn. Here, what is this? He just spawned with zero HP and died. It was my first time seeing phase two. I don't ever know how the boss is before any new game. Plus, I'm so sad I couldn't record it. Sorry. Am I the only one who got this? No, and I haven't recorded. What in the world? What? Mesmer bug. After a couple tries of the boss cutscene before the first and second phase, uh, he said, I think it's supposed to be death dialogue, and after the cutscene, he died. And I received his remembrance and the kindling. I also uploaded the clip if anyone wants to see it. Oh, wow. His second phase is called Base Serpent Mesmer. That's so disappointing. I wanted to fight him. I wanted to be stuck on him forever. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look up a video and I'm gonna watch his phase two. Because I want to see what this is like. That is so disappointing. I'll, I'll still, I'm, I mean, I, I play these games many, many, where, wait, I'm gone. Hang on. Hang on. There we go. <laughs> I play these games over and over and over and over and over again. So I, I will fight him again, but that's crazy. That's crazy. I, I need to see a video of how the second phase goes. He, he plucks out his eye. Yeah, yeah. That's so disappointing, though. Alright, let's see what the second phase is like. Whoa, this is loud. I'm gonna turn that down, turn that down a little bit for you. He was such a fun boss, too. I was having such a fun time fighting him. I missed out on this? Ugh. That is incredibly sick. Okay. Well, alright. Well, this guy's good, and apparently... Like, I, I doubt Mesmer showed all of his moves. I bet he has, like, 30 other... 30 other insane moves that does all that kind of stuff that I didn't see. That I will see, I guess, when I play this again. Ugh. Man, that sucks. That really sucks. Wow. Man, I was so excited to be here for hours. And I... And wait, no, wait, wait. Where'd that, where'd that character go? Where'd that character go? Who was that? There was someone there. There was someone there. Where's the grace leading? Oh, that way, because that's where to... Dude, I'm just missing out on everything now. That is so disappointing. Wow. Unbelievable. You saw someone there, right? Someone was definitely there. There was, there was a person there. Hang on. Now I have to go look this up.
and see if this is a thing. <laughs> uh, well, I guess I will find out. Ooh, that looks extra choppy. Uh, I guess I'll find out later then, I guess. Hey, editing Corey here. I looked up what that NPC was after the Mesmer fight. Apparently, it was the horn scent guy. And he was like mad that I killed Mesmer instead of him or something like that. I hope it didn't ruin his quest line, but I don't know why he would just disappear after the fight. I don't know if it has something to do with me missing the entire fight, but I looked it up. Oh, excuse me. I looked it up and apparently other people are having that issue too. So who knows? All right. Anyway, back to the video. That really sucks. It looked like somebody different. I don't think it was Mesmer. But that really sucks. I, okay, I already did all this. I went across the bridge. We go to Viaduct Minor Tower. I think now is probably... But I can't talk. I think now is probably a good time to... Although, wait, wait, wait. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. The kindling that burns inside Mesmer the, the Impaler, a dark thing eaten away by it, a wicked serpent. Burns the ceiling trees had to be found at the old Rao ruins. Mesmer, much like his younger sister, bore vision of fire. Okay. Where... So the Rao ruins are this. <gasps> this is my favorite area in the game so far. This is so cool. Oops, I removed my my physics flask. Okay, uh, get rid of these. Actually, I'll, I'll keep that one. I want my old buffs. Enhance guard counters. Uh, more runes and HP on critical attacks. Okay. This is so gorgeous. The map fragment is way down there. That's going to be hard to get. I'm going to explore here a little bit. I'm pretty sure there's optional bosses here. Cerulean Coast, this area. I think the only main bosses are like... Divine Dancing Lion, Mesmer, maybe something over here. And then the final boss. Because we're trying to get a flame that can burn the shadow. And this flame burns something here in Rao Ruins. But I need something to burn the shadow after the Dancing Lion. Always gotta check the corners, you know. Wow. Wow. That's such a sick castle. Oh, wait, hang on. Wait a minute. There's something over there. There's some... How do you... How do you get here? How do you get over there? Hmm. I need to figure out how to do that. My goodness. Let me see if I can mess with some stuff here. I'm going to see if there's some way that I can get to the other side. I don't know there is but i'm gonna try uh i i forgot how, how okay I, I i don't know i don't know i'll figure that out later but there's something here this is this is the big thing that the scatter tree is dripping sap into and then there was an item here that i saw as well so i've got that i actually think now i'm gonna go to uh, Cerulean Coast. I think I'm going to hold off because the Grace guides you to the main story and through that. And I want to do some more optional stuff because I've been kind of hard running the main story in terms of like my general progression. I have been exploring outside of that, but I want to do some optional stuff. So I want to check out this area. There's Jagged Peak. I think... There's going to be a massive dragon boss fight inside of this drag, this jagged peak. Because there was a big dragon shown in the final, the launch trailer. The one that I wish I didn't watch. Because it showed too much. Okay, alright, yeah, that was a bad idea. Why are there so many of them? Hello? What 
What is... What are these massive stone things? I'm forever going to be pissed that I missed out on Mesmer Phase 2. Okay, why was that flower glowing? It looked like there was an item here. I'm actually going to switch back to this for the dragon fight. Just because it's easier to fight on horseback with this thing. Oops, tail slam. He moved! Oh, got him. Thanks for killing Torrent, bro. Really appreciate it. Okay. I think he's gonna explode. Oh, 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 oh! I almost died there. That was intense. Oh, of course. There's the tail bash. Okay, Torrent, run. Eat up, boy, eat up. One more. Too many skeletons around these parts. There we go. Sick. Okay. Got to get away from all the skeletons. Where is he going? Just chilling over here, I guess. Just smack his ankles. Okay, figures. Wait, did I get him again? Oh, I did! Nice! Easy, I think that's it. I think that'll kill him. Oh, come on. That's so close. Smack his ankle. Now he's dead. Dragon heart. Ooh, a little bit of lag there. Go back up to this one. There we go. Got it. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. Now we can explore this place. Pe 
There's there's still more. There's still more. You kidding me, dude? That wasn't right. Let me just eh, got him. Okay. Is there a cave somewhere? Some more rata fruit. Okay, lots of points of interest in this area. I'm first gonna head over here. I don't know if this is actually a thing I can go to from the bottom or if it just looks cool and I can get up there. Oh, a deep purple lily. Did I have some of those? Oh, I guess that it grows in the blue flower field at the coast. Like a syrupy poison, its nectar lulls the imbiber into sweet, velvety sleep. Oh, I also... Also, I looked up what I missed because I, I didn't read Rolana's remembrance so I, I just looked up on the wiki what that said and apparently she was like mesmer's mesmer's sword this is right hand woman so i killed her and then i killed mes i killed mesmer i suppose i'm never gonna live that down that's so disappointing but hey, it only gives me more reason to play this over and over again, because that was insane. And now it makes me want to do it again. Not that I wasn't planning on doing it again, because I always play these games a bunch. I don't know what it is. I, I don't like the replayability of multiplayer games. I don't play online multiplayer games, really. I don't do much of that. When I do play online multiplayer games, I play little ones that no one's ever heard of because it's fun to kind of just mess around. And I, and also I'll cheat in some of them sometimes, like browser games, just because it's fun. Just because seeing people mad is fun, but I don't do that very often. I'll do it like one or two days a year. But I love just playing single player games over and over again. I don't know if it's something in my brain, but I love looking at all the games I've played in the past and going, I'm going to play that again. And I'm just playing everything over again. Like, I'll replay all the Zelda games, old FromSoft games, any of that kind of stuff. Why are they surrounding, like, this big tree? Is this tree a fake tree or something? I don't know. It feels like this little circle of them is important somehow. Man, this is beautiful. Great combos on this thing. Let's go. Okay, these these electricity balls are dangerous. Yeah, nearly killed Torrent. Huh. I'm going to hide. I thought it disappeared after Oh, okay, no it did disappear. I was, I was just freaking out. Shadow Realm Rune, not resin, string. What is this? Visions of Mountain. Can I climb up this thing and there's like an item at the top or something? No, it's a steep cliff. Can I kill the crying dudes? I thought the crying dudes were these guys, but I guess those dudes are dead. 
Okay, there's a mausoleum something or other. Whoa, it's a cemetery shade. Actually in a cemetery this time. That's crazy. Yo, the fact that he... Bro just teleports to you, that's insane. Okay. Way easier to kill than his mini-boss counterpart in the... Can I swim? I... Uh, there's no way I can swim that. There's gotta be some cave I go in that spits me out there. There's an island like that in the base game. Dragon Communion Island or whatever. Missed an item. Gravekeeper's Cookbook. Peak Bone Arrow, Peak Bone Arrow Fletch, and Peak Bone Bolt. Animal Bone with Putrid Soaked Tip. Does this... This is a white smoke at the point of impact, luring in foes of human builds who are not in combat and drawing their aggression. Oh! Effective on demi-humans, even if they're already in a combat state. That's cool. So, like, lure arrows. You throw it and it attracts enemies, or you shoot it. Very interesting, that could be useful. Why do I just have my shield? Alright, there's gotta be a cave, or something, over this way, I'm assuming. So I'm gonna explore... Over this way. Oh, there's a grace, which probably tells me that there's a cave nearby. There's at least some reason to be over here, because there's a grace. There wouldn't just randomly be a grace when there's one not too far that way. Oh, I guess it is a little bit far. What's this one called? I didn't look. Cerulean Coast West. Cerulean Coast. I thought I heard something. I thought I heard a frog. It may just be the turtles. Mm, okay, so that's a way to get down from... Wait a second. I haven't... I haven't been up there. How do I get up there? Look at the sunset. That's so beautiful. Wow. The sunset off the coast. That's screenshot. I definitely didn't hit that button twice. That's screenshot worthy right there. I know so itchy, bro. There's a ravine over there. I can check that out. Grave cricket. Let me just see what that is. Cricket that produces a raspy cry. The sound of these crickets are often taken to be the rustling of the restless dead or sometimes the sound of their calling voices. Grave Glove Ward 8. Okay. That's cool. Anywho, I'm going in this ravine, because that's... Yeah. Ooh. There may be something... good under here. Not may, but there almost definitely is. Why are they aggro? Demi-human lord ahead. Oh, I see. Yo! He deflected my... He's he's Sekiro parrying my attacks! That's crazy! Hey, thanks for the follow! I have the Sekiro parry tier thing, so I can do that. Can you maybe not do that, my guy? I think that was a YouTube sub. I still- I thought I turned that off the other day. Why did it- Why is it still giving me YouTube alerts? Let's go. Let's go. Starlight Shards. That's it? Okay. Okay. What is- What am I looking for? Is that- Is that a spirit spring or is it just a waterfall? No, it's just a waterfall. Anything behind the waterfall? Of course not. Foolish of me to get my hopes up. I've only done that, I think, maybe twice. 
in this game. Yeah, it's probably fought, dude. Sit down. Oh boy, here we go. No, I'm not, dude, I'm not. I don't want to fight these guys. I want to fight the demi humans. Look, now they're angry. Now they're angry at me. I didn't do anything. Rude. Okay. Oh, message. <laughs> Appreciate it. Cave. It's gotta be cave around here somewhere. These guys are not supposed to be angry. Why are they angry? Well, at least they're not. Oh boy. There's more demi humans. Okay, well, I'm gonna go in this little cave. Stop, stop, stop! He's about to self destruct. <gasps> Man, this dude sucks. There we go. Okay, yes! Another scatter tree fragment! How many of those do I have now? Wait, where do I see? Oh, they're here, they're here, they're here. I think I need like four or five of them? Or three? Okay, they're blowing up. Where am I going? All right, I'm gonna run. I'm gonna trigger this and run. Torrent is gonna die though. Here we go, there we go, there we go, okay, all right. gonna heal just in case. This weapon is so cool! Except when I mess up. Nice. I really need to level up. I don't know why I didn't level up the last grace. I have way too many runes. I'm almost at a million. I'm gonna drink this just in case. So I don't lose my runes. Where am I currently? Heading deeper in, I guess. Is this where it came from? Yeah, I, I, I believe so. But I didn't see the... Electricity balls there. This area is confusing. We have a summon pool. For what? And a stake of America? Oh, there's gonna be a boss fight up here, isn't there? Oh, is it just a demi human group? That's fine. I can deal with a demi human group. No big deal. We got a demi human queen. And we got just some normal ones. Mariga. Okay. Interesting name. Ow. All right, I shouldn't do that. There we go. And she's too high up for me to even do anything to her. It's fine. The demi-human queens are super easy to kill anyway. If I can knock you caught in that stupid slide attack. Come here. All right, all right, there you go, that's it. That was easy as well. Starlined Sword, I gotta check that out. Stab. Let's read it. Starlined Sword, ooh, 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 it's a katana. Katana with a cross guard, that's interesting. Sword encrusted with a line of stars fashioned from small pieces of crude glintstone. Weapon of the demi-human, there's something to my left, I'm, I'm gonna die here.
Hello? Alright, anyway, I'm trying to read this sword description. Oh, another great knife. Uh, when bestowed with this weapon by their queen, the swordsmen swear to find the truth that lies at the end of the procession of stars. Unique skill. Owns his line of stars. This skill, named after a demi-human swordmaster, imbues sorcerous energy into lined glintstone and executes a slash attack. Repeated inputs allow for up to two follow-up attacks, each dealing greater damage than the last. Okay. Uh, this is just straight up a kitchen knife. Large knife with a broad curved blade. This weapon is designed to slash and rend, inflicting blood loss upon the recipient. Okay. That's normal. Uh, next grace I find, I'm going to level up and I'm going to go back and I'm going to see what I can get for Mesmer's Remembrance. I'm assuming I can get his spear and then maybe some fire attack. I could legitimately cook with this. This looks like a normal kitchen knife. Maybe with a little bit of enhancements on the blade. There's some curvature to it. There's some cool little design. But other than that, I mean, it's got like a little bit of a cross guard. So it seems a little bit more geared towards combat. But overall, it's the most normal kitchen knife looking knife out of every knife in this game. Any caves nearby? That's what I really want. Oh, come on, I was about to get that. Where'd they all come from? I didn't think... Were they really over here this whole time? Elden Ring cooking minigame unlocked. I mean, if I go over here and I start, like, here's some flesh and some turtleneck I'm technically cooking. One could say. Is there really nothing over here? There's really nothing over here. Okay. This area is really pretty, but there has not been much to see or do. So that's a little underwhelming. Why are you cowering in fear? Oh, when I kill the queen, they, they freak out. I forgot about that. But the other ones weren't freaking out? What's up with that? Still no confidence. That's beautiful. That looks sick. Big fan of that. Big fan of all the scenery in this game. Horseback battle required ahead, therefore try jumping. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to just jump into the ocean. First off, it's like a dream. Ah. I think they're referencing Bloodborne here. This feels much like one of the... Not one of, but the Bloodborne DLC. Turn back. Why is it always not here? Okay. I'm gonna go... I'm gonna see if this is for anything. Is this a ship? Is this supposed to be a ship or is this just a thing? Man, I was hoping we would get, like, a pirate DLC or something. Lies of P is getting a pirate DLC, or the DLC that they're working on has pirate stuff in it. Because they were like, hey, we're working on the DLC, and then a few weeks later they were like, here's some screenshots, and one of them is a pirate ship. I'm incredibly excited for Lies of P DLC, I cannot wait for that. I did a whole playthrough of that on my channel, so when that DLC comes out, I'm definitely going to do a playthrough of that, too. Wow! <laughs> Man, this game just... The art direction is unmatched. I think... Is that a ship? It's hard to tell. It might be just a weird-looking Elden Ring ship. But this doesn't feel like a ship to me. I don't know. <gasps> ooh, ooh, ooh. Legendary item. What is it? Okay, great glow... Glow, 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 glow. It's a great ghost glove wart. That's a lot of Gs. Okay, back to 
Back to where I was. I guess there's nothing to do here. Is there really nothing to do? I need... Let me actually... Run along this side of the coast. If there's not, I'll just port back. I feel like there should be something. Yeah, there's nothing. Okay. I'm just going to port back to here. Not there. Um... Here, because what I did, I went through this ravine, there was some stuff, and then I went over here. Now I'm going to just go, uh, but I'm just going to go back. I'm just going to chill here. How do I get to this island is my question right now. I'm going to go here, I'm going to hug the cliff face, and I'm going to see if I can find a cave that leads to that island. Although, I'm going to, I'm thinking, wait, I got to level up and I have to go back. I'm thinking they might be misdirecting me into thinking, oh, let's go, let's go. How do I, I, okay, I still need two of each and three of those. More decks. We went from 501 to 514. Let's go. More power. Actually, how many ruins do I have? Okay, that might be enough. Let me go back to the round table and check this out. Let's see what I get from Mesmer's Remembrance. That I didn't earn. Yeah. Mesmer's Orb shapes Mesmer's flame into a giant orb that soars at foe. An incantation of Mesmer the Impaler summons Mesmer's flame to form a giant floating orb. The orb so soars towards a defeated foe, crashes into the earth, and explodes after a brief delay. Charging enhances potency. Mesmer despised his own fire. Time and time again, he hoped to rid himself of it, but ever did it burn. Spear of the Impaler, weapon of Mesmer the Impaler. A great spear with a warped blade in the shape of undulating flame. Remade by the forging arts of the Realm of Shadow, this weapon can be thrown by executing a strong attack, dashing strong attack, or mounting strong attack. Charge the attack power to check the charge the attack to produce flame on impact. Mesmer's assault, a fierce succession of attacks following a flame-coated spear tip. Repeated inputs allow up to two follow-up attacks. The final move thrusts the spear into the ground, causing countless spears to form in the surrounding area. That's cool. I'm getting that. I do not have the stats for that right now. But, uh, dude, every base... Like, not every base game. Every DLC weapon that I get makes me want to do a new build and try to figure out that weapon's moveset and, like, use it. Like, this, is, this is crazy. You can throw this. It's a great spear you can throw. They're really going kind of crazy with the with throwing weapons here. I think I saw everything here. Actually, maybe maybe this. Okay, so the top of that, there was an item. I didn't go to that. I'm just, I'm going to go here. I was going to go to the other one, but I'll just go here. I'm also going to throw on Mesmer Spear and just see how it works. Here it is. Okay. Spear of the Impaler, unable to use effectively, I know. Let's see what this looks like. <laughs> wow! Look at that. I do not have the stats for it, so it's doing next to no damage. But that's so cool. <laughs> wow. This may be the coolest DLC weapon, utility-wise. Bam! You can do AoE fire explosion at your feet. This is the weapon art! That's so cool! Imagine that, but wreathed in flame. I don't know the stats for it, so it's not doing the thing, but if it was... Wow. That's crazy. Alright, anyway, back to the milady. I gotta head over here to see what this is. I gotta see what a bunch of this is. There's probably a bunch of stuff here. I wonder if I can get from here to the roots. Because I couldn't get there from here. This is a cliff. I don't even know if this is explorable. I don't know if this is... It's probably just roots. Oh, wait. Actually, I wanted to see... I went to see Mesmer's armor. <sighs> I went to buy his armor. I probably don't have the, the money for it right now. I don't have the runes to buy it, but let me check out 
It's armor. Mesmer's helm. Mesmer's armor. Let me just let me just read about it. Okay. Uh the blah, 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 black helm of Mesmer the Impaler slightly enhances incantations of Mesmer's flame, as well as fire knight skills. The winged snakes were Mesmer's constant companions. They were there when the base serpent was sealed away behind his eye. Ah, oh, I wish I got to fight him. They were there through his eternity of suffering. They will accompany him yet in his hideous new form born when he destroyed his grace granted by his mother. They have accepted his fate as much as he. Mesmer's armor, black armor of Mesmer the Impaler, draped with a red cloak, bearing his crest embroidered. On his mother's wishes, Mesmer made himself a symbol of fear, undertaking the cleansing crusade she desired. Direct thy maledictions, thine ire, and thy grief towards me alone. Um, da -da 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 -da. that's the same description. Mesmer's Greaves, that's the same description. Okay. Is there any other... Oh, I didn't read Rolana's info. Ornate helm of Rolana, the twin moon knight, fashioned from silver steel. Rolana, head of the royal family of Caria, was said to have given her younger sister, who renounced her lineage to chase after Mesmer, the gift of lustrous black hair. That's Renala. Um, ornate armor of Rolana, the Twin Moonite, adorned with the lapis lazuli blue that is symbol of Caria. Its radiance is yet to fully fade. Rolana's gloves. Gloves of Rolana fashion. Okay, that's boring. Okay, no lore in, in those. Cool. Let's go back and let's do some more stuff. <laughs> okay, so. Is that an item I see? That is an item I see. Just a glove ward, okay. Let me check out the other big thing that's over here. This? Can I get on the top of this big thing? By any means? Okay, not this way, it looks like. Oh. Oh. Oh, hang on. I'm going to pull off a, a strat here. I, I did the same thing in a different place. <laughs> Love this community. I always find a way to... There we go! There we go! I'm so cool. Okay. I'm not cool. The people who made these messages are cool. First off, well done. Attacking ahead. Really? You liar. <gasps> Cave! Okay, I think that's how you're supposed to get here. Great grave, great, great, great grave, love wart. I can't say that to save my life. Some more grave crickets. Big old cave. Some more ghosty dudes and a ghosty dog. Alright. That's it for here. I'm going backwards through the cave that... I should have gone through to get up there. They're killing themselves! Necessary item ahead. It's not all that necessary, but it's pretty cool. That'll level up your spirit summons to max level. First off, behind, and then ahead. Why are you running, coward? Coward? Chaos. This is a long tunnel. Oh my goodness, it, it every time I think I've reached the mouth of the tunnel, it keeps going. Oh. Big lobster, let's go. Wow, look at that combo. Take that, bro. Okay, you got me with your bubbles. That's a grab. That's a grab. Easy. This is a long cave. This is the longest cave I've ever seen. Bro, it keeps going. I swear, if this... 
Huh? Please just end. Why are they aggroed? It's the longest cave in the world. Oh, we're finally out. Wait. 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 Wait, I... I went backwards. I went backwards. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna shut up now. Cave is still long, though. But I got turned around after the lobster fight, I guess. This was where the lobster fight was. Then I had to go this way... to get out. Still, this cave... insanely long. Ugh! We're out. We're out. We're out. Okay. Where did this spit me out? What? This is the island. That was a mistake. Wow. Okay, I found the way to the island. Take that cave. I don't know if that was the way- because I, I feel like that cave was... was supposed to go the other way. I don't think I was supposed to get to that area and then find the cave. I think I was supposed to go to the cave to find that area. Because you shouldn't have been able to just go on the rock and jump up there. That's definitely not the intended way of doing that. Wow, crabs are too low to the ground for me to even hit. Whatever. What is there of interest on this island? A cave. Yeah, this is Crab Souls. I still have to play that game. Maybe I'll stream it. That could be fun. It looks really good. It reminds me of Battle for Bikini Bottom. Big old thing in the ground. Let's go. You know I'm a fan of big old thing in the ground. I'm actually going to explore up there first because I don't want to miss anything. And I don't want to come back if it's just one dinky little item. So I'm going to do this now. That's one of those games that's super simple, but it'll never get old. Perfumed Oil of Ranach. Uses FP to spell... Oh, 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 oh. Reusable. Reusable. Use FP to spout flames forward, a small bottle wrapped in a bright red cloth, filled with flammable perfume oil. Uses FP to spout flames forward. The dancers of Rana keep these concealed as they dance, marking their height of their marking their height of their passion with an explosion of searing flame and sweet, enticing scents. This is reusable? This is another one of the like use FP to spout flames forward. That's cool. That's something I'll I'll probably throw. Hmm. So it's the same kind of weapon. Maybe I won't hold on to it. I don't know. It's the same kind of weapon as like this one, which chases down foes. These are like little things you can do. There's also there's some other ones in the game that I that I miss. I miss those on this playthrough. Better in the base game. So I I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Help, 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 help. Okay, no, I'm okay. I'm fine. Anyway, let's go down the massive hole in the ground. I love little items like that that are just fun. Hey, here's an item that you can use and you just throw out some flames. You can use it as many times as you want. Southern Nameless Mausoleum. This has a whole name. But it's nameless. <laughs> okay, wait, 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 wait. First off, do it. Um, let me prepare for this. What do we have? Who's in here? 
Dancer of Rana. Wow, she sucked. Hey, I just got that. I just got that attack. Okay, that's a little bit crazy with those attacks, girl. Oh, whoa! Do you give me those swords? Oh, I should- Oh! That's a lot of damage! Why would she just... Ow, 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 ow. I shouldn't have just stood there with my shield up. Ah! I'll take it. I'll take it. Here, take this. Ah! I didn't expect her to turn so fast. Did not expect her to turn that fast. This is not a hard fight. I'm just more aggressive. Oh, she backs up! She dodged my wombo combo. Ow, yep. Don't do it again. Ah! She knew I was gonna do that too. She was super prepared for it. Ah! Ah! She's chasing me down! Wow, she's bad. Here, take a backstab. Oh, come on! Come here. Stop dodging my- You're out of heels. Have another backstab. Come here. Come here. Ah! Every time she's dodged that, she knows when I'm going to do it. That's so annoying. Oh my goodness. Okay, that time she actually got hit by it. Come here. Oops. One more hit. Yeah, you're bad. The end. What do I get? <laughs> Look at the phantom. 96k runes, not that. Dancing blade of Rana. Dancer's hood, dancer's dress, dancer's braces, dancer's trousers. That's a deep red. I love that.
bright red dress of the Rana dancers enhances the power of dancing attacks. The dance of Rana is one of burning passion, and the most passionate dancers never allow their fiery dance to end, losing even their names as they dance on. To see the passion fade is to see the dancer's flame extinguished. Decorative swords ablaze with impassioned red, a pair of weapons made to be wielded in both hands. Used by the dancers of Rana, strikes enemies with a dancing assault when ex executing a strong attack. A furious dance formed by a succession of slashing attacks. Hold the button down to sustain the dance for as long as stamina allows. Ooh, that's cool. Long black trousers and his power dancing. Okay, I might try that actually. Where is this? Okay, it's a little cursed with just the just the hat there. Ooh, this goes hard. Look at that. Let's go. Okay. I'm going to continue on like this. I don't think there's anything else to do here. Although, wait a minute. Why are these things saying things? Light. First off, secret passage. You're lying. Yeah, I knew it. Okay. So that's that. Let's go back to here. Look at the way it shines in the light. That's cool. Looks like satin. Big fan of that. I love vibrant colors. Did I? Yeah, I went that way. That's that's the ravine. That's where I went to go to the coastline. This is one of the coolest looking new uh, armor sets. Okay, so we got some places we can go. We've got, we explored there. We've got this over here. There's a thing here. There's a few more things on the way. Then there's down there. That's where I'm going to head, I think. I'm just going to check for caves along this end. Brave Glove Ward 9. Did I get the item up there? I think I did. Uh, no, I didn't. There's still an item. I think I checked. Great. Grave Glove Ward 9. Ow. Took a little bit of damage. Those are some storm clouds, bro. Wow. Insane. Anything up this way? Nothing. I see nothing. I see nothing. I see nothing. Okay. Yeah, like I said before, this area's beautiful, but there ain't much to do. I wish there was more. That's where the dragon was. Okay. I can continue on this way. I think I'm going to head towards the little peninsula over here and see what this is. It feels like there should be a grace over here. Hello, little guys. I mean you no harm. I mean you no harm. Oh, there's a... Oh, yeah, I didn't figure out how to get up there. I mean, I, I get... No, no, I didn't. I didn't figure out how to get up there. Okay. Wait. Wait. Am I in combat? I thought... Yeah, I'm in combat. What in the world? What's happening here? What is that? Is that sleep? Why are they... What? Why are they angry? Why are they angry? I didn't do anything. Just because this troll is sniping me doesn't mean I did anything. Why are they angry at me, bro? I don't think I can reach that. I'm just going to stay here and, and get him. Nice. 
Can I get him now? No, his head is in the rock. Thanks for that. Very helpful. Easy, okay. Doesn't even drop anything. Oh, he drops a hefty cracked pot. Never mind, that's good. That's worth it. We got a big one here. This is a big one. I'm starting to think these are boats. They're just weirdly shaped boats. There better be some cool boss fight over here. That's a- UGH! What in the world? You look like you reek to fire, let's find out. Yup! Okay, play smarter not harder, go for fire. Nice. I love my build. We got fire. We got daggers. We got spear. We have... Oh boy, there's another one. So is that the way down? Possibly? Let me just check up here first. Alright, I'm not fighting more of them. That's fine. I want to find more perfume bottles. I know there's other ones. I just don't know where those other ones are. What's this? St. Trina Disciples Cookbook. We're going to get some lore. A record of crafting techniques left by a disciple who pursued the teachings of the Saint of Sleep. Yet what seemed a gentle sleep at first ripened into velvet. Acquire the knowledge to craft the following. Eternal sleep grease and drawstring eternal... Eternal sleep grease. Uh, what? Eternal sleep grease. Solidified knot grease made from a mixture of deep purple materials. This looks so beautiful. Coats armament inflicting eternal sleep. The effect lasts only for a short time. The weak are powerless to resist this velvety sleep and will never be roused again. Wow. An even more powerful version of sleep. Sleep is already pre pretty overpowered for some bosses. But that's an eternal sleep? Although it says the weak will never wake up, so I wonder if it doesn't work fully on bosses, if it's kind of the same thing as sleep, maybe a little bit longer. That's crazy. Also, St. Trina is Mikola, basically. I don't think they've outright confirmed it, but all the lore hints point to that. He has like two... He has like an alter ego. Alright, let's go down. I think I've explored everything here. Let's check this out. Where's the nearest go down point? Here. Yo, this is deep. This is deep, I'm scared. This is kind of down there. This is kind of... Oh my goodness, are you kidding me? Okay. 
I need to take this slowly. If there's more, I'm not fighting them. They can just be there. I don't care. They're peaceful enough. There's a grace. Uh. Uh. Music is scary. Uh. Uh, we made it. What is this? What am I looking at? The fissure. That sounds metal. Fissure beneath the coast. I don't know if I can go down there. Can't take torrent in here, okay. I have nothing to say. This is so cool. I'm at a loss for words. Wait, actually... Actually, I... I could... Hang on. I have an idea. Check this out. Check this out. I have an idea. I just had the... I can't believe I didn't think of this before. I can be summoned to some to help somebody else with Mesmer. And I can still see his boss fight. Let's go. This could be it. If it doesn't go after a little while, I'll give up on it. But I'm just going to try this for a little bit. So hang in there. Does nobody need help with Mesmer? Oh, 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 oh. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I have it set to my... Because my, my brother and I were doing that. So I, I had it set to his password. So I wouldn't see anybody else's, of course. Or so nobody else would see mine. Uh, I don't know if you have to redo it or what, so let me just cancel it and re-put it down. We had our password set to PP, and then it only lets people with that same password input. There we go. Okay, see, instantly. Instantly I'm summoned. <laughs> I feel like Mesmer is a boss that people, <clears throat> people really need help with. Let's go. I can still get my Mesmer fight in. There's three of us. Do I have any of those? I do. Drink up, boys! Let's go in! It's time to finally see Mesmer's second phase! I can't even see him at all! I'm almost dead! You really try and Comet Azure on Mesmer? Ow, cheese. Painful. Ouchies. Ouchies. Okay, phase two. Here we go. Where is he? Where is he? I bro, I can't see him. Where? Ah! Can you stop casting your mists? I can't see where he's at. Everyone's scared to touch him. <laughs> wow. Okay. All right. Well, uh, we go again.
Owie. 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 Oh, I messed that up. I forgot there's a delay there for the one attack. How she's... I'm gonna run out of heals. These people are not good. Why is this guy just... I can, okay, I can see why this guy is is summoning help. He's not very good at the fight. Neither am I, apparently. Oh, goodness. These people suck. Maybe I can get some better teammates. The thing is, when you fight a boss with other players, the boss has more health. I think it's one. I think with one other player, it's sixty extra, like sixty percent extra health. And with two other cooperators, it's like one hundred and twenty percent extra health. So Mesmer is like extremely buffed because I'm fighting with other players. Lego! Wow, that was... okay. Oh, he's using... Bro's using the bleed strat. Okay, that's a good idea, actually. Dude, the host is gonna die, and then we're both gonna get kicked. Okay, I need to dodge a little bit earlier for that one to dodge the spikes to come up. Because that's kind of crazy. He is... Host is dead. Host is dead. Wow. Well. That's the end. Massive teammate issues. Imagine dying to his grab. I've never done that. To be fair, the people who are summoning other people are probably bad at the game. I'm one of them. I've summoned before. Okay, now, I've, I've never actually summoned another person for a boss fight, unless I'm in, like, a New Game Plus, or never for a first time fighting the boss. I've never summoned somebody. I'll use in-game summons, like Tish, but I won't use... Really, bro? All that. All right, let me know when you're ready. Keep doing your buffs. You need, you need all these buffs to be good. Okay. Let's go, I guess. Hey, thanks for the bits. Prayer for the good teammates. This guy didn't even summon anybody else. Maybe we'll have an easier time though, because it's... Mesmer's a little bit easier. He, he has only 60% extra health now instead of insane amounts of extra health. Oh, come on. I still, get, I still get hit by that. That's insane. Also, the fact that they have the amount of your heals is crazy. I'm gonna die now. Never mind. I should heal one more time just to be safe. Yeah, that was a good idea. There's a little bit of the Elden... Like, not the Elden Beast. The, the Radagon theme in here. Probably that would make sense because he is a child of Radagon in America. 
who are the same person. Ooh, whoa! Call it. Was that a me skill issue or was that uh, the other guy? Something. I don't know. Oh, there is another dude here. Where did where'd the other dude come from? Okay. There's three of us now. Wow. Wow. Massive skill issue. Wow. The host died again. Maybe I give up on this. People just suck at this game. One, one more, one more, <laughs> one more, <laughs> and then I, then I'm just going to continue doing my own thing. Oh, he's using Blasphemous Blade. Unfortunately, that's not- OH! Unfortunately, that's not going to stop a skill issue! Unfortunately, using an OP weapon is not going to make you better at the game. Okay, this is the last time because that didn't count. That was a three second fight. Throwing my sign down again. 99 times out of 100, this is going to be a teammate issue. Now they're going to make a bad review on Steam. Yeah, now they're going to say this game's too hard. Oh yeah, well this game is so easy, I didn't even need to fight Mesmer's second phase. That's how easy this game is. This game isn't even hard. Bro's running double katanas and Malaketh armor. Let's go. 66% positive reviews on Steam. That's hilarious. This game is a masterpiece. I should just use the shield more. Like, the shield blocks so much damage. The oh, 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 oh. I was literally one shot. All right, that was a me skill issue. One more time. One more time. <laughs> one more time. I want to have a good run. How, okay, how about one more good run? One more good run. So if we get to a run and it sucks, I'll try again. Like, that run sucked. We didn't even get to the second phase. One more run where we at least get to the second phase, and then I'll be done. Wow, the host can't even dodge the first attack. Imagine that. I can do that, and I'm not even that good at this. What are you shooting rot breath at him? I can't even see the guy. That's, that's the big attack? Okay. This looks like it's going to be a good run if I can avoid dying. Yep, this is- okay. This is a good run. Even if we die here, this will be the last time. We're almost in second phase. Please don't die, host. What are you doing, bro? What are you doing, bro? That, that was my mistake. That was my mistake. I dodged. Gaha. Are you going to watch the cutscene? Are you going to skip the... Okay, thank you. What? 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 What killed me? What killed me? What killed me? I had a sliver of health left. I was spamming heal. Okay. 
Okay, well, that's it. That's it. That's all. That's all. I'm going back. Back to the Stone Coffin Fissure. Okay, at least I, I'll, I'll try that at some point. Another spam risk? I've gotten like four spam calls today. That's crazy. Oh, okay. All right, well, at least I saw some of the second phase. I'll take that. Oh, what's this? Oh. It's just one of these dudes. That's it. Is that sleep? Are you inflicting sleep on me, dude? I think that's sleep. There hasn't been any... I don't think there have been any enemies that inflicted sleep in the game before. You could inflict sleep, the player character. But I don't think there are any enemies that inflicted sleep. Which is great, because it's more lore for Mikola and St. Trina. St. Trina's arrow. <gasps> Please tell me there's there's some lore in this cave. I want more lore. I need more Elden Ring lore. Man, these things are so fun to fight. And by these things, I mean just that. Okay. By these things, I mean just the enemies in general. Especially with this move set. The move set on this long what what is it? Not long sword. Light greatsword. The movement on the light greatsword is so so cool. Backstab. I have my shield up, but okay. Oh, if I can get this dude but not the other dude, that'd be nice. Next up. Backstab. Man, these dudes are easy to backstab. <clears throat> one more guy. One more guy. Oh, there's two more up there, actually, too. Ooh, another gra- Ooh, another grace and a cross? Is this a- Is this a main game, like, necessary story area? There's crosses down here. Okay, this goes kind of- This guy's kind of going a little cuckoo bananas. Okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Easy. Come here, dude. Yeah, that's what I thought. Take that. Take that. Get comboed to death. Didn't expect dung. Why is it always dung? Another rune. I can't summon torrent down here. Let's keep going. What's over here? Just a tree? You know I gotta check the co You know I gotta check the corners. We about to get some lore. We about to get some lore. Kindly, Mikola. I see you've thrown away. Something you should not have under any circumstances. How will you salvation offer to those who cannot be saved when you could not even save your other self? <gasps> other self, Saint Trina. He casted he cast away Saint Trina. He gave up being Saint Trina. Is that what is that what this is implying? Message from Letta. Carved words coalesce. I abandon here my love. Okay, everything so far, Mikkel has been abandoning different parts of his body. He's been like, I abandon here my arm. I abandon here my leg. I abandon here something now he's abandoning his love is he like he's pissed he's coming for revenge a message left by letta <sighs> dane passed on a message the ceiling tree is in the ancient ruins of rao yes i know that it lies beyond the high bridge leading from the first floor of the storehouse yeah i found it 
I will join you there once I have finished the task at hand. What is the task at hand? Is it in this cave? Was I... Was I actually making the best decision doing this instead of the ruins? Because this is... I don't have enough to level up, are you kidding me? Let's see if this gives me enough. Probably not. Please give me 20k. 20k, 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 20k. 12k. Yeah, still not enough to level up. That's very interesting, though. Tears ahead. Sadness. Oh, sadness. Fortnite. Oh, come on! Is Mikola... Is Mikola going to turn on the ones you promised to save? That's what I'm assuming. Because we found out that he has Radon and Moog's corpses, and he's going to try to revive them for his own purposes. I don't know what those purposes are, but they don't sound good. Anybody who is willing to take the corpses of two of the hardest bosses in the game and bring them back is not somebody I necessarily trust. So I'm a little concerned about what Mikola's true intentions are. If only I had a beautiful butthole. Okay. Try hole. Ah, seems familiar. All the more could this be ever jail. <laughs> That's funny. Is that bird different? Or have I just not noticed the coloring on the wings before? There's an item over here. Oh, the bird saw me. Or did it? No, it didn't see me. You're blind! You're blind, bro! I'm going for the item. Dung ahead, therefore wrath. Dung. <laughs> Glove War 2? That's pathetic! For the DLC, bro? Come on. This bird has to be different. They did not have this purple... Can you not, dude? Can you... Can you stop? Can you stop? He's doing the thing. He's doing the... Oh, this is a sleep bird. Yeah, no, this bird is definitely different. This bird inflicts sleep. Definitely different. This is so interesting. This is so interesting. What is Mikola doing? What is his purpose here? Dog, but left. Alright, well, I'll put over here, I'll put dog, but right. Dog, but right. Here we go. The right and left horns of this dog. Another message moment. Wow, imagine being a bird and falling to your death. That's pathetic. Item ahead, but no necessary item ahead. Dung. Cemetery flower ahead. It's another glove wart, isn't it? And these things, these things always look towards Everjails. So why are they here all looking in that direction? Yep, it's another glove wart. The music here is also very sad. This makes me think we're about to get some crazy lore revelation here. Dung. On the brink. Checkpoint, and then seek left. Man, these things are tough to hit, actually. Alright, this said seek left. I'm going to see if it's just referring to the thingy or if there's something over here. No, there's no. There's nothing. Okay. Let's continue. Hmm. 
I'm trying to see what I can see over there. I'm probably going to complete this area and then be done for today. What's shooting lasers at me? Bro! Stop! I didn't do anything! Stop! Oh my goodness. Okay. These things blow up. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, I got, I got stuck. Oh, there's a. I'm alive. I'm alive somehow. Oh, okay. I thought my health was done for. Stone snakes shoot lasers. Yep. That's Elden Ring for you. The purple here is crazy. That looks so, so cool. Safety. Alright, I don't think there's anything that way. Let's keep going. Oh no. More games need to embrace purple. What is this guy doing? What? What? I, uh, there's, a, there's another one up there. There's another one. These guys are all going to blow up. These guys are all going to blow up. Let me just trigger them all. Trigger the bombs. Okay. I'm getting harassed. Brave Glove Wart 8. Why is it always dung? Praise the edge. Congeal putrescence. Oh, it can still get me down here? Oh, never mind! I thought I was safe. Alright, let's get this guy. Oh, of course there's a bird in the way first. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, come on! Almost. How do you know I'm here? You can't see me. Oh. It actually does no damage to me, though. It's really just shield. I can guard against it completely. There we go. Let me put a little message here. It says revenge. There we go. <laughs> Just for fun. <laughs> oh, man. We continue. Oh, I'm about to get sniped by this one too, aren't I? Or is he just vibing? Nope. He's not just vibing. Stop! Log onto this guy! Okay, I'm not even gonna bother killing those dudes. I'm just gonna jump down here. Help! 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 Grass! I wanna go home. Item? Is there a grace down- Oh, there's a grace down there! Whoo! Thank goodness! What's up here, though? I just wanna see... Edge. <laughs> Thank you. I want to go home with an edge. Oh boy. Feels good to get a grace. Time to level up now. Throw another point into, into decks. Wow, this goes deep. I'm going to go all the way down there. This might take a while. Grave Glove Wart 7. 
How far am I in the DLC, like, time-wise? 18 and a half hours. That's more than most games will get you these days. Skeletons! Hey! It's the first time we see skeletons in the DLC! Good to see you again, people. I missed you. These are some purple skeletons. They look a little purple. Don't know if it's the lighting or what, but they do look purple. Sorry, I had to kill that dude before he woke back up. Sorry, sorry, skinny boy. Gotta do the same to you. I mean, up! Oh, there we go. Okay. Oops. Sorry. Message was appraised. Yeah, go fall off the ledge. Skill issue. Ah, on the brink. All the more plump sort. Oh, this thing is probably weak to fire. It's a big version of those little dudes. Even so, this is going to take a hot minute. He may drop something useful, I don't know, but I'm going to kill him to find out. Because you never know till you try, right? Let's see. Maybe I'll get a big goop spout. Wait. Oh, there's smaller goops over here. Alright, well, these should be easier to kill. Somewhat. I'm scared he's going to stab me again. Yo, he's killing his children! Almost dead. Come on. There we go. Okay. Congealed putrescence and a smithing stone eight. Not horrible. I still like to kill every enemy. Even if they take a bit like that. Is that a Leonine misbegotten? It is. Oh, we're so screwed. What is this? Nah, no, these guys are actually extremely easy to kill. What kind of moves are you pulling off? Golden Vow misbegotten, I'm dead. Okay, well, that's fun. That's okay, that's fine. Alright, let's not do badly this time. There we go. Didn't even give him time to buff. Much better. Multi-layered ring of light. Fires a multi-layered golden ring of light that continuously inflicts damage. Produces a multi-layered ring of golden light, then fires it forwards, inflicting continuous damage on those struck by it. Charging increases potency. This light ring incantation was cultivated by a tradition separate from golden order fundamentalism. Alright. That's a bunch of words together. What else is here? Do I just progress? Okay, got it. Oh, there's something up there too. Be wary of hole. Thank you. I guess this is the way to go. Wee. What are these? Nectar Blood Burgeon. Nectar Blood Burgeon. A young shoot heavy with velvety purple nectar. Said to burgeon forth where the nectar like blood of abandoned Trina pooled. I think the boss of this area is going to be Saint Trina. Mikola abandons every part of him, divesting himself of his strength. 
he's abandoning who he is. He's abandoning all these different... Oh no. Oh no. All these animals are asleep. Visions of attacking. I'm not going to attack them. Time for sleep. We're about to fight St. Trina, aren't we? We're about to fight St. Trina. Injustice ahead. Boss ahead. Help me in short phrase the message. Offer healing. Praise the message, so to speak. Let there be healing. Offer healing. Praise the message. Okay, fine. Take your... Take your healing, bro. I don't... I don't care. I'll be nice to you. Healing required ahead. Praise the message. Message. Oh, message. Offer healing. In short, praise the message. Maybe I'll throw one of those down. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. We're about to fight St. Trina. Oh, please. Grant me the courage. To fly to your feet, my dearest. St. Trina. Grant me the courage to fly to your feet. We're about to jump into the purple mist and fight Mikola's alter ego, St. Trina, who he abandoned here. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. St. Trina boss fight. Let's go. Oh, what a shot, dude. What a shot. This is so cinematic. <laughs> Visions of Dark Dragon. This, yeah, this feels like Mid Year's Arena from Dark Souls 3. What? What is the putrescent knight? Okay, it's not Saint Trina. It's a putrescent knight, and I have to watch out for the horse as well. Okay. 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 All right. Oh, that, yo, wait, that music goes hard. No St. Trina, though. Weird. Where's St. Trina, then? I thought we are going to fight St. Trina. I, okay, I, maybe St. Trina isn't bad. Maybe St. Trina is down here. But she's not bad. Can I drink my flask midair? Hey, Tish, you want to help a brother out? I don't want to take the five-hour trek down here again. Owie! Owie! That attack sucks. The combo with the horse... Putrescent Knight. I'm getting some frost. Some frost buildup. Where's the frost buildup coming from? Is it just like its weapon inflicts frost? I think that may be it. Dude, Tish is almost dead. This boss is hard. This is like Skeleton Orphan of Cause. That's an insane move.
What's going on? What's going on? What is that? What is that? What are you doing? Oh! Oh, what is that? What is that? Oh, it's frostbite. I'm dead. The horse animations? I think it's supposed to be weird, because the horse is like... It only has its front legs. Its back legs are goop. So it's supposed to be a little janky. Whee! Oh, he's doing the horse wombo combo. I'm dead. Wow, this is tough. Okay. That combo's hard, because it's like, where's the horse coming from? Can't see where the horse is coming from for that. Maybe I summon somebody else. Maybe somebody like Kristoff. Kristoff is more... defensive. Horse is coming from somewhere. Where's the horse? There's the horse. Okay. Okay. Nope. Wow. He just spins cycles. It keeps, keeps just going right into that. Jeez. The harp in this soundtrack is so cool. Big fan of that. Whoa, I dodged way too early. That was my fault. I'm just going to heal again while he's targeted on Kristoff. There's the horse. Here comes the horse again. Dodge the horse. Dodge the dude. Heal. Okay, I survived the horseman wombo combo. That was a really bad place to guard counter. I love this soundtrack, though. Oh, I messed up so badly right there. That's... That is so annoying. If you dodge the horse, you get hit by the guy because he attacks so soon after. I haven't gotten away from that yet. I wonder if I dodge away, if that'll give me a little bit of time if I dodge back. Let's go Tish again, even though Tish died quickly. No, that's the wrong flask. I'm so dead. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, I used the wrong flask. Horse is gonna kill me. Then he comes and kills me. I'm gonna heal again. I'm gonna take the horse and he's gonna hit me. Oh! I somehow did not die there. This is one of the best soundtracks in the whole game right here. This is incredible. Those strings really make it. STOP HITTING ME!
Okay, he, he's doing wombo combo on Tish. And the horse comes. He does it again, and the horse comes. And he does that here. I wonder if the the strat is just to block when he starts doing wombo combo. I think that may be it. I'm gonna try that next time he tries it. Okay, that's that's very rude. Incredible. Incredible. Unbelievable. I wonder if because he's in water, he may be weak to lightning. You gotta think smarter, not harder with some of these things. Uh, 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 uh. Coats armament inflicting heavy lightning damage. Let's do some of this. Let's try. Wow. That's crazy. That's so insane. I think this may just be a blocking boss. Where I just do a lot of blocking and praying. Wow, never mind. I was definitely blocking for that, but that's okay. Slow and steady. Slow and steady. Take it easy. I said heal! Okay, that's the strat, just block. Tish is dead. So, Tish is a bad idea. Guard counter is a bad idea. I should not have done that. I should have... Just not done that. That's a bad idea too, apparently. Apparently any sort of... Hitting this boss at all is a bad idea. From what I can gather. Yep. This is insane! He's so big and his combos hit so fast. That's it. You just gotta guard during that.
Makes sense. Got it. I just have to get better at guarding. This is a boss who works better the more you guard. Except that. Let me do... Because I don't need any of these. I'm not going to be doing any guard counters. Okay. I'm going to go... St HP stamina equip load. Vastly boosts physical damage negation. Raise dex, I guess. And boosts HP. Sure, let's do this. And then in the physic flask, I'm going to get rid of that. And I'm going to go... Maybe spontaneous guard is the way to go with this, actually. Maybe I do try that, since I will probably be guarding a lot. Maybe I try the spontaneous guard thing. Ooh, a little bit of stutter there. Oh, I tried to block that. I did, I did a horrible job of that. Oh, I did a horrible job of that. <laughs> that was so bad. I'm going to throw on different armor as well. This armor looks really cool, but I want stuff that has more defense. Sure, let's do that. Let's see how this goes. This is working, I think. Never mind. It's okay, Kristoff. You got this. You got this, my dude. You're doing so good, Kristoff. I appreciate you. I think this is it. I think this is the build. I think I just had to go a little bit stronger. I think I need to put some- wait, wait, hang on. I need to put some stuff in my weapon. There we go. Yeah, 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 whatever. I'm getting further than I have before. So this can't be too bad. That's insane, that's insane. What do you do to avoid that? Do I just try to run away? It's just if that touches you, you're dead. Do I run away? Do I frantically roll? What do I do?
I'm hitting a lot of these counters. I wonder if that'll make him stun like in Sekiro. Ah, fair. Alright, he's doing the big thing. I'm just going to back up. I'm going to get out of the way. Okay. I think I see it, maybe. This is also just painful. We're below half. This is working. Alright, he's gonna do wombo combo, which is easy to avoid now that I know what to do. Here comes the horse again. Block. Oh, okay, cool. And I can heal here. That's actually sick. Okay, I did not mean to heal at all. I'm just gonna take it. I'm gonna block and, and I'm gonna take this damage. That, okay, that works. That works. I can just tank the damage. That's actually perfect. I can just block and tank the damage. Dude, blocking is the key to this fight. I figured it out. Uh, okay, I, I messed up there. I... I panicked and I like, oh, I didn't mean to block there. I tried to do the Sekiro thing where you like spam it. It didn't work. This is the best feeling when you finally start to get a boss and you're, fi you're figuring it out. The way to counter it is just to block. And if you use the tier that enhances your block, it only makes it better. My bad. Then he goes bam, bam, and the horse comes bam, then he goes bam, I messed that up, then the horse comes again, bam, bam, and heal. Perfect. Oh, I messed that up too. That was my fault. I got greedy. Okay, go for... Go for Kristoff real quick. Thank you. Just need to coat my sword again. Perfect. Perfect. I think he's going to do the the thing yep all right i just stay away and i block and take the damage block and just just take the damage just take the damage tank it tank it tank it heal there you go that's not even that bad get some more stamina oops my bad Oops, that was my bad too. Thanks, Kristoff, for taking the hits for me. 
Appreciate it, my guy. I messed that up. That was my bad. That was so my bad. <laughs> oh, so close, so close. Horse. I messed that up. Horse again. Him again. Run. Get some hits in. Perfect. Back up. Heal. He's going to throw it at me. The heal did nothing. May as well not even healed. I need more stamina. Gonna heal. Oops, I forgot I did it twice. That's my mistake. He missed. He's an idiot. Back up. Tank the damage. I guess I don't need to back up, actually. I can just stay here. Heal. Maybe throw another lightning grease on there. Oh, bad idea. Block the horse. Block him. Block the horse. Block him. There we go. Run in. Get some hits off. He's doing that. I need to dodge and I need to... He does a second one. There it is. Guard counter it. Get some hits in. Beautiful. 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 Oh, I'm so good at this. He's going to do a slam. Nope. He's going to do this. I need to heal. And then just tank the damage. Just tank the damage. Just tank the damage. Just block and tank the damage. It's fine. Heal, 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 heal. I forgot there was a third one. I thought the second one didn't hit me and there wasn't going to be a third one. Lightning up. Let's finish this sucker off. Woo! Block. 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 Horse. Block the horse. Block him. I missed blocking him. That's okay. Block the horse. Block him. That's okay. Going to take this opportunity to heal. Gonna run in, not get some hits off because I'm an idiot. Gonna block. I could have blocked there. I should have blocked there. He's gonna slam. He has another slam coming. There it is. And then we guard counter. And then we back up. And then I try to get some heals off. If I can. If at all possible. And now I heal. He's almost dead. Let's finish this. Take that damage. Hit him a couple times here. Take the damage. Block. Block. Heal. Block. Block. Kristoff's almost dead. I don't care. He has a second hit. He's going to go for Kristoff. He's dead. Woo! Oh! <laughs> Man! Getting into the rhythm of that was so fun. That is a great fight. That is a great fight. Man, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, for people who don't have those kinds of builds, that was probably not a great fight, and some people were probably struggling with that a lot. But once I figured that out, that was a great fight. Wow, that was so much fun.
I love this game. <laughs> ah, okay. Let me read about him. Remembrance of the putrescent night hewn into the scattered tree. The power of its namesake can be unlocked by the... All tainted flesh eventually becomes putrescence, and this clump of it imbibed St. Trina's nectar, which granted it eternal rest, and so it was that putrescence became her night. Huh. St. Trina's night. So was that St. Trina... Well, wait, no, no, actually, actually, hang on. Actually, no, I'll, I'll, I'll stick with this armor set. Uh, let me just put my stuff back here how I like it, though. Lover ahead. Is this St. Trina? Are we going to see St. Trina? Death ahead. I, wait, I, I didn't rest. Oh, no, I, I, I did. Try death and then listen carefully. Ah, lovable sort, so to speak, time for grass. What is that? Visions of Sadness. St. Trina Disciples Cookbook. A lulling branch. The bewitching branch? Where's the lulling branch? Slowly build up sleep while, gra while gradually restoring FP. What's this? <gasps> is that St. Trina herself? Imbibe nectar. Why am I drinking the nectar? What? No. Seek death. In path ahead. <laughs> sure, buddy. Wait, what? why? Whoa, 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 why am I fat rolling? Oh, from these. Okay, fine, I'll take off the hands. <gasps> oh, well, we found St. Trina. Not sure what purpose this serves yet. I'm assuming there's some way you can, some way you can drink her nectar without dying, I'm assuming. Wow, this boss room is so beautiful. Yeah, I'm thinking there's some way you should be able to drink her nectar without dying. Let me go back to the round table hold and see what I get from this remembrance. Putrescence cleaver or vortex of putrescence? Launches a whirlwind of putrescent jars that explode shortly after impact and bathe the area in ghost flame. In an age-long past, death was burned by ghost flame. Even the remains of tainted flesh were given equal treatment in death. Weapon wielded by the putrescent knight, a great cleaver of hardened putrescence affixed to an arch, fashioned from human bones. Gains power from the wielder's arcane attribute. Okay, so that's an arcane build thing. Uh, spinning guillotine. Hold the putrid blade at both ends and arch body backwards to deliver a powerful overhead chop. Repeated inputs deliver follow-up attacks for as long as stamina allows. Stronger attack performs a leap, followed by a spinning attack. I'll get that. That's pretty cool. Wow. Okay. So we found St. Trina, who Mikola abandoned. So now I have two options. I can go here and go to the, the Jagged Peak, or I could go to the Ruins. Considering the Ruins progressed the story, I think I'm going to head to the to the, the Jagged Peak, and I'm going to end the stream for today. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Thank you, YouTube people, for watching the video if you made it this far. Uh, oh, wait. Um, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hold up, hold up. Wait a minute. I just remembered I didn't fight the magma worm in the dragon pit. I'm gonna actually do that first. Oops. I tried to block that.
There we go. Okay, rude. Let me get a head off, dude. Why are you just walking? Come back, bro. Tried to shield through that. That did not work. Come on, he's almost dead. Just finish this guy off. Oh my goodness. Well, come over here then, dude. Fight me. You won't, coward. There we go. Okay. Magma worm killed. I think that clears everything in the dragon pit. There's an item over here. Let me grab this and then I'll end the episode. Yep, that's it. Thank you everybody for watching. I appreciate your support and your views and your follows and subs on Twitch and bits and all that fun stuff. I'm going to run up here to this little foot of the jagged peak right here and just kind of End the episode on this view. Look at that. Does it get better than that? This is what I'll be tackling next episode. Thanks for watching. See y'all later. Bye bye.